I'm going to talk about live streaming on the smart controller as you can see here. Uh, to start we're going to have to download on the arcade so the best way I could think of was just to use APK Pure. As you can see we just type in there and then go into Omelette Arcade. it's there on the top so we just download that so a 22 meg file so we just tap onto that download You can see the progression of, of the download by going, swiping down, and then tapping on this icon here. And once that's complete, you have the install here. Once you have Omelette Arcade installed, you tap onto this icon here and you have Omelette Arcade in this screen. You tap onto it and then you have the options to sign in or create a new account. Once you have Omelette Arcade signed in, you can now press the plus button here and you can either screen record or go live if we go into the live section uh, ignore that you have to first initiate the program so adding more games you'll get a list of programs which are installed in the smart controller I've already selected it therefore I don't need to do that. Instead, I just uh, press pl the plus button and then go live, and then it's there to be selected. And then from there on, you can select which platform you want to stream Facebook or YouTube. Say, if I wanted to upload to YouTube beauty of this program now is that I can do it mobily and I don't need a thousand subscribers so I press next title your uh, stream and detail the stream put in your uh, um, links and so forth and then press start it'll count down to from free and then it'll live stream the beauty of this thing is now you have two programs running in parallel. You have the DJI Go 4 app and the uh, Omelette Arcade, which is running in the background, but in parallel with the drone interface. And you will have this orange icon here, which you can float anywhere on the screen. Basically, when you tap onto this, uh, you can stop recording or you can stop the live stream from here. Additionally, when you're using two programs separate from each other, you can now live stream, stop one program and still continue to the live stream without interrupting the live stream. What I mean to say is that now I'm still live streaming on this screen, but I can now stop the, the drone, take out the battery, replace it, and still continue to live stream, which gives you a longer stream 
rather than stopping and starting for each battery swap of the drone aircraft. I hope that this tutorial on how to load up Omelet Arcade and play it in parallel with your DJI GO for live streaming purposes helps you with your live stream situations. Please subscribe and like this video for some more hints and tips and I'll see you again. Cheers.